All right, well, welcome to week nine. Yeah, you guessed it, we're down here by the, uh, the Philadelphia Zoo, a place that you can uh, check out some lions, tigers, and bears, of course. You know I was gonna work that in. Uh, this week, the Eagles play against the Bears. It's a little recap on last week. Flat out lit up the Dallas Cowboys, exactly what I, what I hoped would happen. I'm not gonna say I'm gonna think that, because I think that every week. When we lit up the Dallas Cowboys, when we lit up that defense, that run defense that was supposed to be all number one and all great. We uh, pretty much shot Rob Ryan. Now, I could talk a lot of trash and talk about the feet or whatever. Uh, let's give him a little credit. He said that we whooped them like we we're supposed to. And you don't want a coach to give up on his team, right? You want a coach that fights, but so sorry that you were, I mean, you're a coach of the Cowboys. So, Rob Ryan, I mean, you stepped up to the plate and said that we beat you, but now it's time for you to get a little quiet since uh, we whooped it pretty bad. Wait until next match and fine, whatever. But well, we own it today. We own it last week, so go birds. Now this week, it's kind of weird. Uh, Jay Cutler, he's in and out. I mean, I can analyze all I want, but you never know what you're going to get with the Chicago Bears flat out. As Philadelphia Eagles fans, we just got to worry about what the Eagles are going to do. Shady McCoy, he's going ridiculous. He's scoring all sorts of ways, scoring in every game. Had 185 yards last week. That's awesome. Mike Vick, no picks. No turnovers by the Eagles. Great offensive line. Jason Peters, welcome back. I'm still waiting for my man, Winston Justice, to get back, so I'm going to keep praying for your legs, you know, and for your injury. Hope you get better, get back on the line. But our our, our defense is starting to play together. Awesome while you had the interception. I was, I still want to see Asante Samuel get an interception. That's my guy. Um, and then a lot of hype this week over Jason Avant. He's talking about, you know, bandwagon fans, this and the other thing. And if you take it out of context, yeah, fine. You can get all mad all you want. The fact of the matter is, if he's talking about bandwagon fans, I'm not worried because I'm not a bandwagon fan. I prove it every week going around Philadelphia. So this week, I'm just looking for the Eagles to keep rolling. Keep it rolling, right? And, you know, put the Bears in the hibernation after this game. Let them worry about next year and what they're going to do for next year's plan. But this is Eagle time. So I just hope the Eagles win this week. And uh, let's just give them our best like we did last week. Let's keep it going. Let's keep pace with the Giants and the Cowboys, and just, just keep it going. And as always, E-A-G-L-E-S, Eagles! Go Birds, baby! Bye.